Oh, what's all of this? Ah, it's Mundo Cuckoo's friends in the wonderful world of geometry, right? Are you interested in finding out how these shapes work? Good, and would you like to do it with your friends? All right then, they're on their way. Hello, Day. <sighs> Tell me, what shape are you on? Is it a big circle? That's right, a circle, yes. And you can draw a circle by doing just one round line. And it resembles a... Uh, it's like a wheel. Plus, it also resembles the planet we live on called Earth. Hello, Vicky. You're almost at the top now. Are you standing on a circle as well? Ah, that one's a triangle. Well done, Vicky. It's a triangle, that. You can see that it has three sides. There's one, two, and three. And it really resembles a mountain. It's also like a pyramid. Let us move on to the next shape. Who's going to guess what the shape is now? Ah, oh, it's Jerry. Do you know what shape it is? Is this one a triangle too? If not, then, is the shape a square? It is. This one is a square because it's got four equal sides. That's one, two, three, and four. It resembles, uh, it's like a window. And it also resembles, uh, a frozen ice cube. So now tell me, what geometric shapes have we learned today? A circle and a triangle and also a square shape. Hold on, what's happening over there? What new shape is this one, ABC? Yes, it's a rectangle. It's also got four sides like a square does. So one, two, three, and four. But wait, the two sides are longer than the other two. And it resembles a, a cell phone. Or maybe a door. I wonder what could be behind the door, ABC. Shall we see? Oh, look, it's the most wonderful world of geometry. Let's go in and play. Today we will learn geometric shapes. Let's do it. This is a square. It has four equal sides. One, two, three, four. Now let us find the square object. Very good! The room's window is square. This is a circle. It has no angles. Let's look now for something circular. has the shape of a circle. This is a triangle. It has three sides. One, two, three. Where can we see triangles in this room? Flags have the shape of a triangle. This one is a rectangle. It also has four sides, two short sides and two long sides. Can you help me find something rectangular? Yes, 
the bookcase. You have done great. Now that you know the shapes, you can play to find them everywhere. See you next time. Today we will learn the numbers. One. One sun. Two. Two balls. One. Two. Let's go ahead. Three. Three cookies. Delicious. One, two, three. Let's continue. Four. Four candy bars. One, two, three, four. Perfect. Five. Five ice creams. I love it. One, two, three, four, five. Excellent. Six. Six flowers. One, two, three, four, five, six. Very good. Seven. Seven stars. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. On to the next one. Eight. Eight chocolate eggs. Wonderful. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's continue. Nine. Nine balloons. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Perfect. Ten. Ten pencils. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Excellent. Let's go over the numbers together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now, could you help me count? How many suns are there? One sun, very good. How many balls do we have here? Two balls, excellent. And here, how many cookies are there? Three cookies, perfect. How many candy bars are there? Four candy bars. Great. And now, how many ice creams are there? Five ice creams. Very good. How many flowers are there? Six flowers. Excellent. How many stars do we have here? Seven stars. Perfect. And here, how many chocolate eggs are there? Eight chocolate eggs, amazing. How many balloons are there here? Nine balloons, very good. And now, how many pencils do we have here? 10 pencils, excellent. You did great, see you next time. Today we will learn by meeting our three little friends. The first one is the sphere. Hello, sphere! Its shape is round and smooth, like a ball. The ball has the shape of a sphere. But can you imagine anything else with that shape? The orange! The orange 
has the same shape as the ball, but it's smaller. What else is spherical, huh? A planet! You see? It has the same shape as the ball, but the planets are far larger than the balls are. Oranges, balls, and planets have the same shape. They are spherical, but they have different sizes. Small, medium, and large. Who else can we find here? The cube! Hello, cube! Its shape is straight and firm, such as this present. The present has the shape of a cube, but what else is that shape, huh? A dice! Very good! The dice has the same shape as a present, but it is so much smaller than that. Do you know what else is cube shape, huh? A building, that's right! Look, it has the same shape as the present, but the building is far larger than the present. The dice, the present, and the building have the same shape, the shape of a cube, but they have different sizes. Small, medium, and large! Very good, let's go on! This one here is a cylinder. Hello, cylinder! Its shape is a curve, but it can stand firm as well. The glass, for example, has the shape of a cylinder. But, um, what else has the shape, I think? I'll help you! A birthday candle! The candle has the same shape as the glass, but it's smaller, you know? Can you think of anything else that is cylindrical? A rocket, that's right! The rocket has the same shape as the glass, but it's so much bigger than the glass, right? The glass, the birthday candle, and the rocket, they all have the same shape. They are cylindrical, but they have very different sizes, right? Small, medium, and large. Very good. Now you know the difference between sizes. We had fun, didn't we? Keep watching our videos to learn through play. See you next time.